in three, two, one. Let's go ahead and go. Yeah. So, so, what's poppin' guys? In today's video, I will be showing you guys how to live inside a cow in Minecraft Pocket Edition. I know this is so crazy and it sounds so weird, but you guys uh, will understand everything very, very soon. So, if you guys are hyped for this video, don't forget to go ahead and drop a like down below and subscribe if you guys are new around here. And uh, let's go ahead and get straight into today's video. So, so, so guys, I'm sorry for interrupting you in a really exciting moment of the video, but I do want to mention that I do have a Instagram, which is underscore FlaxYT. Uh, it should be on the screen right now, so you guys can go ahead and follow me from there. Or if you do want to follow me directly, there is a link in the description down below, which will take you directly to my Instagram. Make sure you guys go ahead and follow me there because I'm trying to post regularly and I'm posting uh, real life stuff. So if you guys do want to stay up to date with my uh, real life stuff, make sure Make sure you go ahead and follow me there and I can't wait to seeing uh, all of your guys comments there. Anyway guys, enjoy the rest of today's video. So guys, what I'm about to show you is exactly what it does sound like. So you guys will be able to live inside a, uh, a cow which is uh, not even one block of length. So uh, yeah, that's pretty crazy guys. So let's go ahead and get straight into the tutorial. So the first thing that we will need is a cow spawn egg just in case we do not have any cows near us. So this is a cow spawn egg and then let's go ahead and get the some block colors that are the same color as a cow. So we are going to go into here yeah? and uh, we do have the brown which uh, is exactly like a cow and then let's go ahead and get as well some light gray because uh, a cow is brown and light gray so that is that now we are going to get a little bit of windows and uh, that's pretty much it guys you can get a door but uh, I will not get any doors in my personal opinion it's better if you do not get any doors so let's go ahead and find a little flat area or uh, let's actually dig straight down so I'm going to do that and I'm actually gonna speed up the video because uh, otherwise it will take forever guys so let's go ahead and do that right now I do think this is uh, pretty enough for now so that is gonna be enough so I'm just gonna fill everything from up there and uh, catch you guys in just a moment So guys, I'm uh, back here in this little carriage, whatever you like to call it. So uh, we are going to now make a little space for everything. So let's go ahead and give you guys the dimensions. So we need to be removing 15 blocks from that way and 15 from that way. So let's go ahead and start counting that. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I think that's 8. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. And we are obviously going to block that out. So there we go. Let's go ahead and do that, guys. There we go. Let's go ahead and place a torch here and let's go ahead and get 15 here. So one, two. Oh my goodness. That was the best area that we could have spawned at. But anyway, so uh, one, two, three, four. Oh my goodness. Uh, I'm messing up everything. So one, two, three, four, and then five, six, seven, eight. Seriously. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And let's go ahead and go out. So 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Oh my goodness, that is terrible, guys. 13, 14, and 15. There we go. Now let's go ahead and go 15 blocks that way. So 1, 2, 3. We are already doing 3, 4, 5, 6. Oh my goodness. 7. There we go. 8. Nine. That is terrible, guys. Ten. Eleven. Oh my goodness. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. There we go. Now let's go ahead and fifteen block that way. So we are going to dig as well. So two, three, four, five, six, and then let's go ahead and start uh, building. So there we go. And we are going to count now. So. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 
13, 14, and 15. There you go, guys. So we did make the whole room. So now let's go ahead and actually dig it off. And I'm going to replace the whole floor with a little bit of brown and a little bit of light gray. So I'll see you guys in a moment because it's so hard that we uh, got spawned into here. So let's go ahead and do that and meet you guys in just a sec. So guys, I just finished building the uh, little terrain over here for the house. It was so hard because we had all of these uh, gravels and all of that. But just a little tip for you guys, if you do want to break uh, gravels really fast, you just place a torch on the bottom and then when it will fall, it will break everything. So just uh, in case you guys did not know about that, uh, you just got a new tip. But anyway, let's go ahead and now fill all of these sides with the uh, brown and then we will hopefully get on with the exciting stuff. <laughs>
So guys, we are pretty much done with that. I'm just going to put a little final touch on the uh, on the roof because obviously we do need to have a little bit more stuff on it. So let's go ahead and just get rid of that. And we are going to get a little bit of sea lanterns. So let's go ahead and do that. And we are going to find approximately the middle of the uh, the room so there we go that is pretty much the middle and what we are going to do is to hopefully dig straight up and put some of these sea lanterns so let's go ahead and do that over here and hopefully I actually did it right because I think I did it one block away but let's hope yeah I was right guys I did it one block away so let's go ahead and remove that and replace these with that there we go, so that is pretty much that. And now we are just going to put a little bit of these white uh, grey blocks over here. Just colour it around and uh, hopefully it will look pretty similar to a cow, guys. I'm not too good at building, so do not judge me in the comments, guys. But uh, make sure you guys go on creative and do what you can. So there we go, we are pretty much done. Just going to put a little bit here because uh, we missed here quite a lot. But there you go, that is pretty much how uh, the house look like. And uh, to be fair, it does look like a cow, so I'm really happy of that. We are just going to leave one hole right here and uh, dig straight up, guys. So let's go ahead and do that. I know we just filled it up, but we do need to make that, otherwise we will get in a bad position. So there we go. We are going to uh, set the word, uh, or actually, we are going to get... I'm not sure why it is called. Oh, yeah, so it's spawn point, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I think it's spawn point, so... Let's go ahead and do that, guys. And there we go, spawn point. And it's gonna give us the coordinates. So there we go, that is what we needed. And uh, yeah, that is actually really good because that's all we needed to do. We did not even have to break anything from there, but it's all right, guys, I guess. But now what we are going to do is to go ahead and get a command block by doing give at s command block. So there we go. And uh, now we are going to put this straight over here guys i do think that is the middle let's go ahead and check that there we go i was right guys and one here just like that guys and hopefully this will uh, allow us to get back to the normal world so in, the, in just a moment you will understand everything guys but for now just follow these steps and you will hopefully get it right so let's go ahead and do now uh, right here so it's tp at s and then uh, we are going to get the position so 30 and there we go so let's go ahead and do 30 and then 71 i think and the last number should be 91 so there you go i was right but do not want to miss uh, anything so there we go let's go ahead and do that so tp at s and then uh, it was 30 i think 71 and 91 let's go ahead and double check that right now and yeah it was right guys so uh, there you go now let's go ahead and cover it up with some brown wool and uh, hopefully this should tp us guys so let's go ahead and get a button from here we are going to get a wooden button because it's the same color guys and uh yeah let's go ahead and press it uh is there a problem home i'm not sure guys let's go ahead and just do it on that side is there a problem or I'm not too sure I think it's because we did not place it on here nope so it's TP at S and then that yes this should be right guys let me just go ahead and check that so TP at S and then the coordinates so it was 30 91 and then uh, what was it oh there we go 91 so that is that yeah it is the right place guys what what is going on maybe we need to add a slash maybe that's the problem let's go ahead and just try that oh so it's no target matched oh so we might need to put a p instead of an s guys there we go let's go ahead and try that out and there you go it does work so make sure you guys do not put s and put a p instead so let's go ahead and dig that side as well we are just going to change the s with a p and this should be right, guys. So there you go. Let's go ahead and do the same on uh, this side. And now everything is working, guys. So we are pretty much ready to get started. So we are going to, just for now, set the word spawn here. So let's go ahead and do 
uh, what is it actually? <laughs> I'm getting confused with all of these numbers because I do not do normally commands. But anyway, set world spawn point and uh, this should give us the coordinates. So let's go ahead and uh, just keep that now. And we are going to make a little fun thing on this house. So let's go ahead and break these. We are hopefully going to make this pretty good. So we are going to get some of these bookshelves. And we are going to make a little thing over here. So uh, let's go ahead and just uh, decorate the stuff. I'm actually going to cut the video, decorate it and uh, get back to you guys very soon. So there we go guys, we are done with the design, that was actually so hard to make because uh, I didn't make a plan for this But anyway, uh, we do have a kitchen over here which gives you uh, real food from there So that is pretty cool, we do have a little uh, item frame with a bucket of fish We do have this paint over here, the sleeping area and then a little chilling area with a lot of books So that is pretty cool Now we are going to go ahead and go upstairs and get on the real work So what we need is a command block a a uh, cow spawn egg and then we are going to get just uh, some cobblestone and some brown uh, wool actually not wool the brown whatever it is and then the last thing that we do need is uh, this right here so a redstone comparator so there we go we do have that and now let's go ahead and get upwards and uh, hopefully this will be easy guys so we are going to go up here. There you go. That's why I expected no cheap, no uh, cow. Sorry. So let's go ahead and do slash effect. So uh, effect right here at e, just like that, guys. And then brackets type. So I'm just going to say it slowly so you guys don't get confused. Type equal. We can either either do a uh, name equal whatever you guys name it. But I'm just going to make all the cow go slow. So uh, we are going to do cow over here. And now we are going to do slowness. So slowness, slowness over there. And now let's go ahead and do nine 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 space nine nine equal to true. And this should make all of the cow actually slow guys so that is pretty cool i'm just gonna check if i did anything wrong nope so let's go ahead and do enter so i just realized that i actually did a mistake on the code it's a cow with a o not an a i uh, don't know how i did that mistake but anyway let's go ahead and do enter 
and uh, place this over there. There we go. And this cow should actually go slow. So now let's go ahead and dig just underneath it over here. And we are going to do some quick stuff. So there you go. We are going to make this command go over there. Place this. And then hopefully it will go to this one. So there we go. Now we are going to actually get some grass block. And we are going to cover this around. So we are going to do just one little thing here. Which is uh, going to be always active and repeating. So we are just going to do something real quick in this command. And it's going to be test for. So test for. Just like you it and then at e uh, at p actually and then brackets and we are going to do r equal three so basically it will detect when you do a uh, walk on here you will see found flat variety or whatever your name is so now let's go ahead and go here and do tp just like that guys and then let's go ahead and do at p and we are going to be finding what we did before so so the position that we were at is the 29, 22, 83. So let's go ahead and do this over here. So 21, uh, 20, actually I'm not too sure, but anyway, 29, 82, I think, uh, or 92. I'm not sure guys, I actually got confused because I received a SMS. But anyway, let's go ahead and do that. So 29, 22, 83. So 29, the reverse that I did. So 29, uh, there we go, 22 and uh, 83. So hopefully I did this right. If not, uh, I will just correct it now. So let's go ahead and do that right now. So 21, 22, 83. So that is correct, guys. Now we are going to cover this up and uh, we are going to do one last command, which is uh, game rule. So game rule. And then we are going to do command block output, so there we go, equal to false, guys. So just like that, and uh, you should not get anything popping up which will annoy you. Now, the last command that we need to do is to go ahead and do uh, set word spawn to here, just so um, we do not get any messed up thing, guys. And now let's go ahead and go down over... Actually, let's go ahead and walk here just to test if it does work. And there we go. It does work, guys. So let's go ahead and go up here. I'm just going to fill out this uh, hole right here so it doesn't annoy us or no one find our secret base. So let's go ahead and actually uh, just go over there. And uh, now let's go ahead and place this over there. And there you go, guys. We are done for real now. So let's go ahead and actually go into here. And this is our lovely cow house, which uh, looks so giant, but uh, it's just a cow, guys. So we are outside. And let's go ahead and walk over to... Uh, to here and hopefully there we go guys boom voila guys this actually work oh my goodness guys we are actually going to try this one more time so imagine that you were talking to your friend and you're basically uh, telling him that you are gonna go inside so we are gonna go inside that go in three two one let's go ahead and go voila guys this house looks so so insane Oh my goodness, guys. I can't believe that this is actually possible in Minecraft Pocket Edition. This was like a horrific cave. And now it's a lovely, jubbly uh, cow house. Oh my goodness, guys. We are going to get out now. And this is so insane. Like, imagine that you are with your friend and you're just walking like that. And boom, you disappear, guys. That is so, so, so cool, guys. And you do not need to be in creative just in case you guys saw... So, what are you doing, sir? Oh my goodness. Uh, if you guys thought that you need to be in creative, no, you do not need to be in creative. Well, guys, we are back here. And uh, let's go ahead and hit this guy and get out because... Uh we do not want to get in a fight with him. But anyway, guys, I do hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys did, don't forget to go ahead and drop a massive like down below. And subscribe if you guys are new around here. And make sure you do turn post notifications on because YouTube is so broken. And uh, videos are not going to subscribers. So make sure you guys do me a favor by dropping a massive like and turning the post notifications on. And if you guys do comment on today's video, I will try to heart your comment and reply to some of your guys' comments. So uh, if you guys do want to talk to me in the comments down below, make sure we start a conversation down there. And I will see you guys in my next video. Peace out, guys. That is so, so cool.